Dreaming Medansa, Chapter 16, Segment 4. Antipsychotic medications revolutionize the treatment of schizophrenia. Lobotomy, the surgical separation of a portion of the frontal lobes from the rest of the brain. It was a treatment for schizophrenia, but did not work. Chlorprosamine, or its more common name, Thorazine, the first drug that was effective in treating the positive symptoms of schizophrenia. The positive symptoms it treated were auditory hallucinations, delusions, and disordered thinking. Neuroleptics, antipsychotic drugs that traditionally function by blocking postsynaptic dopamine receptors, and that would be dopamine D2. Dopamine hypothesis, the hypothesis that people with schizophrenia suffer from an excess of either dopamine release or dopamine receptors. Typical neuroleptics, those are antipsychotic drugs that are D2 receptor antagonists. Tardive dyskinesia, a motor side effect of some neuroleptics that's characterized by involuntary movements typically of the tongue or difficulty walking, which may be debilitating, and it can last long after this um, stopping of medication use. Atypical neuroleptics. Antipsychotic drugs that don't have a selective high affinity for dopamine receptors but block other types of receptors, such as certain serotonin receptors. Despite popular portrayals, most people who develop schizophrenia recover appreciably. Many people develop schizophrenia as young adults and then go on to recover and live normal lives. Prior to neuroleptics, people with schizophrenia were not able to recover. Several factors are associated with recovery from schizophrenia. The better the person was functioning prior to schizophrenia, the better his recovery will be. Better recovery is seen in people who are married, educated, older at onset, and have supportive family and friends, and better recovery in more rural than urban settings. Bipolar disorder is more like schizophrenia than depression. Bipolar disorder, a mental disorder characterized by periods of depression alternating with periods of excessively expansive mood. Men and women equally affected. Age of onset earlier than depression, before middle age. Lithium, a chemical element used in the treatment of bipolar disorder. The mechanism of how lithium helps is not truly understood. Studies have shown that communities drinking water with more lithium content have lower incidences of depression and suicide. Are people with schizophrenia and bipolar disorder dangerous? Media and fiction incites bad stigmas with schizophrenia and bipolar disorder. Sure, there are a small percentage of people with, with these illnesses that display violent behavior, but most of them are not violent, and they're more likely to hurt themselves than others. Scanning for schizophrenia risk. Endophenotype. A group of behavioral or physical characteristics that accompany inherited susceptibility to a particular disorder.